Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today's Wednesday, so it's what you're working on Wednesday. So today, I haven't crocheted at all. <laughs> I have been sewing today to make uh, some bags. I only made five. I'm going to put into my shop to sell, hopefully, so that I can fix Jesse's tablet, hopefully, next week. Um, he broke it. I don't know if you watched yesterday's video. He broke it by accident yesterday, the screen. It's, that's all it broke on it is the screen. It still works uh, behind the screen, you know, the... The inside part <laughs> um so i contacted a local place here uh that fixes cell phones and tablets and things and he told me how much it would be to fix it and then plus taxes i'm sure um so i'm trying to scrounge up that money uh because it's not something that's normally in the budget obviously you we don't plan on things like that happening so i made some drawstring bags today i started them yesterday i started cutting them yesterday but i actually sewed them today and they're all done if you're seeing this video they're in the shop right now uh, i'm not doing like a official shop update because it's just five bags <laughs> um but i will put it on here and on the facebook group so there's only five so it's first come first serve i guess uh and they're really cute i have to say i used fat quarters to make them that i have, I have been gifted a long time ago and i've been slowly picking from the box i got uh, like it's a good size box bigger than a shoe box of just rainbow of fat quarters and uh i've been slowly making things out of them so i made these five bags but i just made them in like sections and I used similar colors and they all have just white liners but they're the same on both sides <laughs> and the tops up here are kind of different each one's on each bag is different I just used pieces of the fabric so they're just regular drawstring bags the regular size I always do I like this is my favorite one it reminds me of like water and swimming <laughs> there's that one and this darker blue is pretty like this reminds me of Red Heart Super Saver Monet <laughs> the yarn and then I made this green one and then this one's like browns so I just whipped these up today uh, just to fund fixing his tablet it's gonna be $90 to fix it plus taxes I'm sure um, I don't know if it's 90 on the nose like I don't I don't know for sure I guess I'll know when I drop it off <laughs> um, but the guy did say that the parts are already there so that I don't have to wait for him to order anything. And he said it should take, because they have to like melt part of the screen, like the glue around it to get it off. And then when they put the new screen on there, they have to like clamp it to let it dry. So he would said it, it would take a whole day and then we could come pick it up the next day, you know, next business day. So I'm hoping that that's true. <laughs> Cause Jesse uses his tablet a lot, especially in the evenings before bed is when he gets on it the most. Um, and he misses it <laughs> and we have like a crappy cheap tablet here that we had before he got his ipad for his birthday two years ago he got it from my mom two years ago um and i, I booted it up yesterday and it barely works it's just a cheap um uh, one from walmart the walmart brand <laughs> it's like on i think is what's called uh and it just does not work very well at all but anyways so these are in the shop if you want to check them out there's also a couple of the zipper bags still left in there and i put them on sale just to try to get rid of them i know they're smaller which is probably why they're left but uh, i was just trying to use up scraps if they never get bought i'll just end up putting them in giveaways but that is what i worked on today is these five bags and um so i guess that counts <laughs> but uh yeah so let me know down below what you guys are working on feel free to share any links or people or anything like that and also let me know what you're doing for dinner i already cooked ours we eat dinner early because of devin's work schedule we eat dinner when he wakes up and then me and jesse and june eventually would just eat something else later in the day but um we made i made pork chops and potatoes in the air fryer and also made some rolls i tried some new freezer rolls i normally get the um to white bag it's like mrs some I can't remember <laughs> rolls but this time i tried the roads i think rolls and they're really good they take forever to rise you have to get them out of the freezer three to five hours before you intend to cook them because <laughs> it takes that long to rise uh today they took about three almost four hours to rise to double in size because they have to thaw out first uh and i cooked them in there came out really good they're like restaurant rolls but i also found a recipe on youtube that i want to try making rolls I have everything here to make them. I might try to do that when Devin's off. Uh, he's off tomorrow and Friday. Because um, I need help <laughs> with the kids. But um, I want to try like home making them. And if they turn out good, then you know I can just home make rolls. But uh, I'll share that link below if you want to check it out. It's a uh, 
can't remember the YouTube channel name now. I subscribed to it because after I watched that video of his, uh, I went to his channel and he has a bunch of recipe videos, so I subscribed to him. <laughs> but I'll share it below if you want to check it out. Um, but yeah, but that's what I made for dinner. <laughs> so these, like I said, will be in the shop if you're seeing this video. Um, there's only five, so I don't know how long they're going to last. But I hope you guys like them with the sections. I was just trying best way to use these fat quarters because there's only one of each. Um, so I can't make a whole bag with one print. So I'm just trying to cut them in different ways. <laughs> to um, Last time I did like a big hunk, half, like two thirds of the bag was one print. And then a, one third of the bag was a different print. So this time I just thought I'd do in thirds. <laughs> so um, I'm just playing around. But yeah, this one here is my favorite. Because it reminds me of like a swimming pool. Especially this one. <laughs> like swimming, it just looks nice and cooling. But I'm going to take, I took pictures of these already. So I got to go make the listings. And then I got to edit this video and get it up. And then they'll both be up whenever you see it. But hopefully I can get his tablet fixed next week. Oh, I feel so bad. I felt so bad for him when he broke it because he was crying and it made me want to cry because he was crying. And it's just, it's just sad. But yeah, I'm going to hop off here and go do the computer work I was just talking about. And then, um, do something else the today. June has been super clingy today. I think she's teething because she's super grumpy <laughs> the last few days. In the last couple weeks, she's been drooling like crazy. Like it's a constant flow and her shirt gets all wet. I keep filling in there and I don't feel any little bumps yet. But Jesse got his first tooth when he was five months old and she just turned four months. So I think it's coming. <laughs> but, um, she's just been really, I haven't hardly been able to put her down today. <laughs> she's asleep right now. Um, every time I set her down, she just starts crying. So. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. I've got a few planned this week, uh, the rest of this week, but I don't know if I'll actually get around to doing them uh, just because of laugh. But you'll see me when you see me, I guess. And I'll see you guys when I see you guys. <laughs> Bye, guys. Yeah.